So guys, these are, these are the three things that I use over the years uh, to uh, lose weight, um, get in the best shape of my life, be transformed, be renewed. Um, and you know something, it was something that I didn't even really notice until not too long ago I was going over my journey. Cause it's been, you know, I've been doing this for a long time and it was like 20 plus years ago um, or that um, I was 300 pounds and um, I was overweight. I wasn't sure how to lose weight. I didn't know what to do. And so it was really like three things that really helped me not necessarily, not just lose weight, but keep it off, you know? But I'm gonna share the, uh, the principles that I, I use over the years and hopefully, you know, you guys can use them. Uh, so the first one uh, was that you have to have an accountability partner. Uh, uh, have somebody that's gonna uplift you, push you, uh, that's gonna uh, hold you accountable. If, they, if they're on the same journey, which is a plus, because that's what's part of my, that was, for me, I had my dad. My dad found out about me being overweight from my aunt, and he gave me a call. He gave me a call, and I was actually trying to research and stuff like that, and my dad was like my first accountability partner. Um, we started doing uh, Slim Fast together. Uh, we both was on the same journey. We start doing slim fast together and we talk like almost every day. Uh, we get on the scale every day. We send each other um, updates about each other and all these different things. So, and my dad, because of my dad uh, doing it with me because of his own journey, it just made it so much easier to be honest. Uh, it was times I was down, he would lift me up. It was times he was probably down or whatever. He lift me up and then he had more knowledge about slim fast than I did and then we transitioned over to Weight Watchers. And when we did when we did that, man, the game changed for real, for real. Like we were just dropping like weight like crazy. <laughs> and, uh, and we was eating stuff that we didn't even think we could eat. Uh, if anybody don't know about Weight Watchers, it's a point system. And they had all these booklets. They have booklets and they have like a guide and how much, like a banana could be these many points and this could be, pizza could be this many points and because how much you weigh and all these different things it shows you how many points you get and I, I probably honestly that's probably the most fun I've I had um, on a weight loss journey journey because you find out a, I found out a lot about myself and again I, my dad he was there with me man and you know I didn't even realize that I still use that too because every time I about to lose weight I tell somebody that's close to me like, y'all, I'm about to do this and this and this, and uh, just to hold myself accountable. There's even times I even went on social media and post how many times I was gonna lose weight and all these different things. So, so the first thing you have to do is get your accountability partner. Uh, they don't necessarily have to be on the journey with you, but somebody's gonna hold you accountable and it's gonna push you and lift you up because the journey, you know, it's gonna be, it's gonna be some highs and lows for sure. And the second one, honestly, you, and I'm gonna keep it real, you kinda gotta hate your current situation. You kinda gotta hate what's going on in your life when it comes to your health and your wellness, your physique. Men and women, no matter who it is, you kinda gotta hate it. I mean, like, really get mad when you look at yourself in the mirror. I used to look at myself in the mirror and be pissed. I hated that person. I, I just didn't like what I saw. And that was like one of the things that triggered me too, man. So I hated it. Like even before my dad called me, um, I was pissed. I couldn't stand it, man. I, I was, I hated being obese. I hated, I mean, it got so bad. Even when I used to go play basketball, I hated being called a big man. <laughs> I'm like 6'3", but I was like 300 pounds playing ball. I hated it. Like, yo, I got big man. I hated it, yo. I hated it, yo. You know what I'm saying? Because I I, I was so messed up. When I heard big man, I, instant, I instantly thought of being fat. I did. And that was, that was drove me. I mean, thank God that my dad called because he was, he was able to educate me through the whole process. 
but um, but before that, I was already enraged. I was already hating. I was already secretly crying to myself, and like I hated being fat. So even now, like I would, like I would, I used to do bulk, bulk and cuts. It's only but so far I will go before I start looking in the mirror like, mm, I, don't, I, don't, I don't like this. It's a lot of times I start gaining weight on purpose, man. I will lose it. I will lose it right away because I wasn't ready for the bulk. I wasn't ready to gain all that weight. So the second thing is you kind of really got to want to change. You kind of got to really hate your current situation because a lot of people say they do, but your actions don't show that. You have to hate hate when I say hate I mean that hate your current situation you have to hate it or you won't change and the third thing is uh, turn your motivation turn that commitment that you made yourself into discipline honestly like, for real it, it, it just won't work if you don't and the reason why I say turn it into discipline is because life still happens and you have to dis be disciplined and want to be disciplined. Uh, this weight, that weight loss journey that I've done those years, those many years ago, uh, taught me discipline because I had to be accountable for myself, even though I had my dad, but I had to do my part. I had to be accountable for every single thing. I had to be accountable what I ate. I had to be accountable going to the gym. I had to stay on myself and that turned into discipline because at the time I was a college student you know what I mean so I still had to go to school I still homework and all these different things I think at the time I was like y'all I want to try to I want to play basketball for them and all these different things and uh, you go out I was meeting people because I was going to school in Maryland and I was meeting people and stuff like that I had to say no to a lot of stuff I had to say no to at the time I was staying with my grandmother down there, I had to say no to certain things. Like you want this a lot, I had to say no. I had to be disciplined. I had to stay on it. You kind of, not necessarily get crazy, but I got crazy with it, but you gotta build discipline because I'm telling you it's going, it's, it just makes it harder because the thing is motivation is not gonna keep you coming and pushing because I'm telling you, it's gonna be times you're gonna wake up in the morning and your feet gonna hit that floor and your mind gonna say, get back in bed. Get back in bed. Hit the snooze button. Go back to sleep for like another, give me another five minutes. You build up that discipline, your feet hit that floor, you already know what's happening, you already know what time it is, you already know what you're about to do. Even when you don't wanna do it, you're a dragon to go brush your teeth and use the bathroom. You barely got your eyes open because you know why you build discipline so you your mind is already on on that type of time your your your, your mind your soul your, your spirit man your, your flesh everything it's a war going on as you walk into the bathroom <laughs> so the, the, the number three thing is discipline you know what I'm saying you got to build that discipline man and let me tell you man that your weight loss journey you're going to be I don't want to say hell but it's gonna be hell you're gonna hate it Honestly. So those are the three principles that I use that's still in my mind today, that's still part of me, that still help me uh, lose and gain weight and all these different things. Uh, you know, I, 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 I use accountability partner. I, I remember, I don't forget what, I don't forget those days. And um, I used the discipline that I instilled all these years to lose the weight I want to lose every single summer before summer hit every time every single time so use those guys i mean seriously um get a get somebody that's gonna push you i mean yes hate hate your current situation and and build discipline in the journey that's it you will never fail those are those three those three for me me to you. See you in the next video.